Subscribe to Keto and Tea and hit that notification bell. Thank you. Keto and tea. I don't ask for much. I simply ask for a thumbs up. Can you thumbs up the video? Come on in. Subscribe to the channel and turn on your notification bell so every time I upload a video, you can get the message. Or even if I do a live stream, you can definitely get that message too. And also, right by the subscribe button, there is a join button. Consider becoming a neighbor today. And over in the membership, we be taking care of our mom, bodies, and soul. We be talking about health. We be doing all that good stuff. Helping each other along the way. So, y'all, I did a live. Wait, let me fix my camera. Ooh, look blurry, Jim. Is that better, y'all? I'm sorry, y'all. Y'all had that little blurry look. Y'all, I did a live stream last night. And I ain't going to hit the panel. Can't hear the truth. And we was over there on my live laughing and talking about the events from yesterday, y'all. So if y'all like more of those lives where we do commentary, you know, light shade on what's going on around here in the community, let me know. But you already know, 227 will be this weekend. So what I'm trying to figure out is if I want it on a Saturday or if I want it on a Sunday. So y'all vote down in the comments. 227 on Saturday or 227 on a Sunday around let's say maybe 6 7. I think 6 7 o'clock would be good on a Sunday if we change our time slot. But let me know what y'all think about 227 on a Sunday around 6 or 7 o'clock because I was looking at my analytics and things like that. And from the looks of it, everybody be outside on Sunday nights few people be out on Saturday nights, but you know people go out to events and stuff on Saturday. So, I mean, Saturday is good for a certain time slot, but Sunday nights and even Friday nights, people be outside, according to my analytics around here, around my channel. So y'all let me know what y'all vote, Saturday or Sunday, because we will be coming on this weekend. So I think I'm going to open the show with some commentary around the sector a little bit when we uh, do 227 then we get on into that pop culture and things like that but we got to stay current around what's going on here in the sector you know why because it's a lot of stuff going down but it's so much stuff that you cannot you cannot keep up with it like so many channels now so many debacles you just can't keep up with it all so what I'm going to do on my morning rides, I'm going to do my best to bring you the news and of what's happening around here on the YouTube streets. Now, you already know we were live about um, over there in the J4K sector. is a content creator called Mama Chosen, and she hosted a panel and a few people from the Stand Strong sector, I think that's what they call themselves now, the Stand Strong sector, because they are not in the Monk Bank Tea sector, so they are called the Stand Strong sector, and they went over there, um, got themselves into a little situation, they was coming over there to address another content creator that they call Dead Girl. So they were going over there to address Dead Girl, and they ended up into a whole nother situation with Monica Mo Justice now. 
I'm subscribed to Monica Mo, and I do watch her content. And when I'm watching her content, she usually like she's usually when I'm watching her content, she's like nice, calm, nice tone, never raises her voice or whatever. But yesterday, over on that panel, I saw a different a different Monica Mo. I was like, wait, that's Monica doing it? That's Monica talking like that? Monica Mo went in. Also, if you want more information about that, that live stream, check out Money Boy Trey. I put his link in the description box. Uh, check out Money Boy Trey. He also did a live last night and they were covering that topic. So to get an understanding, to learn some of the backstories about the J4K, he had a few members of the J4K, I guess uh, they no longer the J4K members, I guess, like now what in them, they were on his panel. So if you want to learn a little bit about that history, go listen to Money Boy Dre, go catch up on that. Then we had Truth, she went live earlier that day for the early part of it. She was addressing some situations that was going on in the sector. All I'm going to say is this, y'all. From giving commentary is one thing. Having an opinion, that's all fine. But when you, and this is for the other people that keep finding themselves into drama and conflict. Stop inserting yourselves in other people's business and then you won't get other people's drama. You inherit other people's drama because you always inserting yourself. You go around digging. You want to know this. You want to know why. You want to do this. You want to do that. And then when people do their commentary, they they not they don't do commentary. They actually just be coming for people. But it's a difference from doing commentary and coming for people. But a lot of these people tend to be they just go in attack mode. Like for an example, check out Silas Mukbang. I saw that she uh, did a video. I want to say on the overnight. And she was addressing a, a, a YouTuber. She addressed a YouTuber who took her video and mixed it with another video and said that she was coming for, for another YouTuber. Like, and that's not simply true. That, that's not true. So when you out here and you want to, people want to do YouTube. People want to have fun. People want to do, Silas is a content creator. She does news reportings. She report on the monk bangers. She report on a lot of different variety of things. So I'm going to put Silla's uh, link in my description box as well. Silla's does commentary. She is a content creator. And so people sometimes don't like her content for whatever reasons. And then just because they don't like you, they want to paint and stand to you as this vile, evil person. And they want to get a hate group going against you because this one channel don't like you and then all the members of that channel and their supporters begin to hate you and not like you too because this youtuber don't like you so that's the risk you take when you coming out here doing this content like as for me like i said i'm still going to come out here and do my content do my commentary and have an opinion but i would so all the content creators that i mentioned money boy trey silas mukbang uh, true perks and all of them Go check out their live streams You know, tell them Raina sent you You know So I'm about to go get this coffee, y'all Y'all know yesterday When I came around here, they had a new person Working Y'all remember, what was it, sometime last week They had a new person So let's see, I might have to Order my coffee Then I'm going to let y'all go but if you have an opinion about everything that has been going on so far around here in the sector, drop down in the comments and let me know your thoughts and opinions. Let me know what you're thinking. Let me know if you caught our live stream last night. Hold on, let me order this coffee. Good morning, I can help you? Yes, can I have a large hot coffee, please? Skim milk? Yes, thank God you're working. I know. <laughs> Anytime, I know. <laughs> Uh-huh. Yes. Yes. And free donut. Oh, you said free donut? <laughs> oh, 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 oh
free donut. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Yo. You know, I don't even eat the donut because I can't because it's full of sugar and stuff. So what I do is hand it off to a co-worker when I get to work. Yeah, it was nice to give somebody a free donut. I wish I could eat that. Yo, my favorite donut back in the day was a Boston cream. Oh, let me see. Hey! <laughs> Good morning. Be paid for this, y'all. Thank you. Thank you. Look, y'all, my favorite favorite donut was a boston cream back in the day y'all know what them boston creams is with the chocolate um icing on top with the vanilla pudding in the center thank you let me get my coffee with the vanilla pudding yes thank you okay. have a good one all right everybody <laughs> yo if i showed them this video they better give me a deal with Dunkin' Donuts. They better make me go viral with this damn coffee situation. <laughs> this coffee situation. Yo, let me tell y'all about them Boston Cream Donuts. Boston Cream Donuts was my downfall, y'all. Woo wee. But they don't be giving me no um, Boston Cream Donut. They be giving me a glaze and shit. The one with all the shit. The one I really can't have. <laughs> but I'm gonna give it to a coworker. So anyway, y'all. Oh, for my live from, from last night. Did y'all catch I ain't going doing her CMA impersonation? Yo, she get on my nerves. <laughs> I think Coco B say she going live today. I gotta put her link in the description box. So y'all. Anyway, y'all. I don't know. My message. My met look, I can't even get it out. My message for today is stop inserting yourselves in other people's drama and taking on beef because you already know beef keeps them clicks and views going. But the problem is when you have any more beef, they're not going to come over and watch anymore. But some people depend on this, this beef to keep their channels afloat. But if they had no beef and then if they had to do positive commentary, the views won't be viewing so they have to insert themselves in beef in order to keep that drama going that conflict they live off of that they you know that's their thing that's your thing but just try not to attack other innocent people and include them in your stories and your narratives because that makes people you know you get turned off from youtube that's just what it is but I'm babbling now, so I'm going to end this video. Don't forget to like this video. Drop me a comment down below. Let me know your thoughts and opinions on what's going on around here in the sector. Uh, let me know. And I, told, I think I'm going to do a video today at 4. I might do a video today at 4. Depending on uh, who go live early in the day. Because y'all know I got to do my little shift at work. So when I'm at work sometimes and I got downtime, I can hit a few lives, you know, catch up on some things if people go live during the day. So I'm out of here, y'all. Bye. <laughs> Bye, y'all.